I am Anil Kumar and here is a very interesting question for our middle school students. The question is find four consecutive odd numbers that add to 104. Now let's understand what is consecutive, right? So consecutive numbers are numbers which come together. What I mean to say here is one after one after another in a sequence. Now here we have consecutive and also odd. Consecutive and also odd. So the two things are combined. Consecutive and odd. And odd numbers are the numbers which are not multiple of 2, right? So multiples of 2 are even. So that is what it is. So we are looking for consecutive odd numbers. Let's understand. So we are looking for consecutive odd numbers. What will that mean? That means numbers like, uh, let me write down few, like 11, then skip 12, 13, skip 14, 15, skip 16, 17, skip 18, 19, and so on. Such numbers are consecutive odd numbers, right? So they are odd and they come one after the other in a sequence, right? In order of increasing or decreasing. Do you get an idea? So these are called the consecutive odd numbers. Now, the question is, find four consecutive odd numbers that add to 104, right? So if I add, we should get 104. We want those four consecutive odd numbers. I hope the question is clear for you. You can pause the video, answer, and then look into my suggestion. Okay, let's try to think over it. We need some of uh, 104. Is that okay? Sum of 104 of four numbers, right? Four numbers. That means average should be how much, right? So 104 of four numbers. Is that okay? That means what should be the mean or average? Let me write average first. Or mean. Mean will be 104 divided by 4, correct? So let's do it. 104 divided by 4. So we get 104 divided by 4 equals to 26. We get 26 as the mean. Okay. So mean, which is the center value, is 26. Now we have to figure out four consecutive odd numbers. 26 is even. It doesn't help us. But can we find the answer with the help of 26? Hmm. Let's think about it. So 26 is the average. Average, you'll remember, may not be the part of your solution, right? We are looking for consecutive odd numbers where average is 26. How about taking a number on either side? So if I write 25 here and 27, still the average will be 26. But we get two odd consecutive numbers. Now, can you give me more consecutive numbers? Yes. One less than this is 23. One more than this is 29. Now, let us add these numbers. 23 plus 25 plus 27 plus 29. What do we get? Let us see. So we have 23 plus 27 plus 25 plus 29, right? I changed the order, but well, it gives me 104, same number. The idea is, since 26 is the average of these four numbers, 26 times 4 is going to give me 104, right? So that helped me to find the solution. I hope you understand and appreciate this concept and also understand how we can use average or mean in some applications. I'm Anil Kumar. You can always share and subscribe my videos. Thank you and all the best.